The number one way to reduce your day trading losses is to do this one secret quote unquote strategy, if you will. <laughs> it's basically to actually care about day trading like your life depends on it because it does. Now, to give you an example of what I really mean by that is I had a student by the name of Rick who did one-on-one -on -one coaching as an example a long time ago, actually. Uh, really great guy, really down-to-earth guy, really friendly and everything, talked a lot, uh, which I really thought was amazing because I talk a lot, so obviously we really kicked it off. Uh, <laughs> but what ended up happening to him before he found me was that he, the short version, worked at a startup, uh, worked 70-hour weeks, which he thought was amazing, but of course he couldn't see his wife and daughter that very much. So he came home one day early to his uh, uh, to his family, and what ended up happening, what he saw, was his wife cheating on him in his own bed inside of his own house, which of course broke him. So he went into a spiraling depression to where he said, the job is the reason my wife cheated on me, and I need to get my daughter out of the scenario because his wife was also doing other stuff, which I don't want to disclose. Uh, so. He's like, I want to give my daughter a better life, which I imagine some of y'all can relate to if you have children or if you want freedom because of trading or whatever it is. So uh, Rick ended up trying to find any kind of program that would help him out. He finally ended up joining my program so he can do some stuff. So what uh, Rick ended up doing from a trading perspective is that he held way too long on any trade, you know? Because he was basically wasn't trading again like his life depended on it. Because again, it did, but he didn't realize it. So Rick would say, hey, so I made a, a winning trade. I made, we'll just say $1,000. Great. That's good, Rick. But he made a losing trade. Hey, I lost $15,000. Okay, Rick, you were supposed to sell here, not here. <laughs> Why did you sell down here? You know, then we have the conversation about it. What the, the flip for him was this conversation that I'll, I'll just disclose to you all uh, personally on this video here. It was, hey, Rick, we need to talk about this because we have pre-planned entries, pre-planned exits for wins, pre-planned exits for losses, but you're not following them. So let's think about this from a, uh, uh, the correct perspective, with, put the correct lens. So, and everyone here, you all can value, get some value out of this. When it comes to day trading, Rick, this is what you need to do, and this is what I told him. Get Cut out a, uh, an image of your daughter, put it on the bottom right of your screen, and just tape it there. So when you're day trading, you can see your daughter in the bottom right. So before you ever click the button to enter a trade, look down at your daughter's photo and ask yourself the following question. Is this trade that I'm going to enter worth putting my daughter's life on the line? Because realistically, if it is, you'll enter it. If it's not, and it's a stupid trade that doesn't follow the strategy, you're not going to enter it because this is not your money, Rick. This is your daughter's money and your daughter's future. You can't, you, you can't put her life at risk like this anymore. You told me all the horrible things that happened with, uh, uh, with while you know being married to your wife, previous wife. So, you need to make a choice. Is every trade you're doing that losing a lot of money worth her not getting the future that she deserves with her amazing father? Because I imagine it's not. Every time you enter a trade, so talking to you now, if anyone listened to the video, every time you enter a trade, you have to think the exact same thing, whether you use a photo in the bottom right, or you take out a different photo, or you just have just the internal thought of, what am I trading for? Because if your why is bigger than making money because it's cool, then you'll always be a successful day trader because there's values behind you actually clicking the button. Because we all know making, let's just say, a dollar a day from day trading can be relatively simple because you just click buy and click sell very quickly. But making a thousand dollars a day can be, even though maybe me maybe the exact same trade, but you're adding more money to it. But it may be scary because there's more money on the line. But if you're scared that more money's on the line, the only thing more scary is putting, let's just say, your daughter, your son, your spouse, your entire family's life at risk. So you're not going to just enter every trade just because you think it's cool and you want to buy a stupid Lamborghini. So hopefully that story actually can help someone. Hopefully someone listening to this video can actually make turn their life around from a, uh, getting day trading freedom, if you will. Uh, freedom with, by actually doing day trading. Because it's real life. It's not just, hey, technical analysis is the way to make money. No. Your life and your family's life is important. So actually treat it like it is.